Hey, what's up guys? It's Yetta here, and today we're going to be playing The Walking Dead. It's an awesome zombie game on PS3 and Xbox 360. If you've never heard of it, I recommend you at least try Episode 1, because it's a really, really good game. And other than that, I have some other good news as well. I have come up with a name for all of my subscribers. The Yetta Army. I know it's awesome, right? But anyway, for now, let's just concentrate on the game. Let's go. The game series adapts to the choices you make. That's smart. I wouldn't believe it or not, I've never played this game before, but I've heard a lot about it. The Walking Dead in red letters. Episode 1, A New Day. Okay, so we're in a car and we're handcuffed. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Um, I'm gonna choose the bottom one. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Top one. Not for me. Because guys in your position already said it. Don't worry, I'm not going to keep saying what decisions I'm going to make in future episodes. I like the way the trees are like being reborn every time you move forward. That's kind of awesome actually. Look at the bridge, it's like it's coming up from the ground. Freaking awesome. Oh my god, I'm supposed to be looking around. Sorry guys, I didn't even notice. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. What do you think? I'm just glad I chose law and not order. Big messy trial like that, even if you was innocent, a lot of what happened can't ever be undone. Let's look at the radio. Any of that seem important to you? All of it, but that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a six year. You meet your wife in Athens? Yeah, Lee did not like you that question at all. Uh, sure. Sure. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Oh hell no, <laughs> um, could be I did, <sighs> I guess he didn't want to say it, look at that helicopter, something serious is going on, oh crap, look at all them police cars, Jesus. You'll have to learn to stop worrying about things you can't control. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you sit. 
Then before long, he starts Look at Lee's face. He's like, like, damn, like, damn man. Oh, hell no. <laughs> I tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. The, uh, yeah, I'm going to choose the bone one. So did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people that guy really has problems. They believe their life is over. Well, I got another good one for you. Oh my god, look in front of you. Oh my freaking... Dude, so. dude, oh There's shit. Oh my god. Oh, what the hell? He didn't look. Oh my god. This should be an advert for police awareness of the roads. Oh my god. Was that a zombie just walking past the window? I can see that there's one up there at the top of the um the hell. Now it's gone. I think that guy got killed by the zombies because he was screaming. Oh shit. Logic. How long has he been in this car? Hey! Hey, officer! Are you alright? I'm still cut back here! I was paying more attention to the shotgun on the floor. How the hell did he have his gun out? Why, I don't know. Uh. Sarcasm. Let's get out the window, man. I need to drag myself out that window. I believe I can fly. Whee! Come on, if I was in this situation, I would not go anywhere near that police officer. I would, I would just get the gun and then I'd maybe go next to him to get the keys. Ah, uh, there's a shotgun shell on the floor. I like the way your knee was down. That's that's called the badass knee. Looks empty. Like you just. It'll be like you're about to run in the Olympics. Off. And you've twisted your leg or something. I don't know. Sorry, but I would have took that shotgun. Officer. Even if I would have just rested it on that rock behind me. I like the way he was so scared about getting the keys, yet he's standing right above him. And he could like grab his leg and bite his foot. Officer. Oh my god, I knew that was gonna happen, I knew it. Holy shit. Where's the shotgun? Dude, get the freaking shotgun. Dude, ain't nobody got time to look around, get the shotgun. Quick, grab it. Put the bullet in. Oh my god, are you freaking serious? Grab the gun. Grab the bullet, I mean. Hurry up, hurry up. Quick, quick, we're gonna shoot him in the head. Wait, was that purple blood? 
And now it's red. Logic. Man. I am the doctor. I will find you. Smells like shit. And I will eat your purple head zombie. Hello, little girl. Go get someone! There's been a shooting! Look at me like, oh god, what have I done? Oh no. Oh crap, you're screwed. Run, 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 run. Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. He fell. Come on, keep a pace, bro. Keep a pace. There's millions of them. Oh my god. Oh my god, are you serious? You fell again, Lee. Come on. Do it for Yeddo Army. Get over the fence. He just about made it. If he would have tried to climb it and fell, he would have been dead. Because it would have ate his brain. Looks like they heard some shotguns. Okay, just ignore what I just said. Hello? Anybody? What I was trying to say, they heard some gunshots. But I was too confused to know what I was saying. My god. Anybody up there? Nope. This is how all the gangsters walk. Yo, yo, what's going on, bro, bro? Hello. Come on, open Anybody the door. I need a little help. Looks like we're going inside. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Since when did it get so sunny outside? What the hell? I'm not an intruder. Or one of them. These people might need more help than I do. Yes, I'm guessing they do. Cause no one's here, I don't think. Other than a little girl somewhere. Uh, fruit. Let's get some fruit. It's fake. Damn. You just got trolled. Oh my god. Furniture overturned. So let's just look around a bit. Jesus. Maybe there's something on there. Let's go into the kitchen while we we'll listen to it. Is it playing? Oh, there you go. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. Hey, oh my god, Lee. Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the Wait. hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER. Are they our handprints? Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so I we're sure staying hope an extra are. day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message two. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave yeah, the I'm city guessing they and take died. Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three. Left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. 
If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Awesome. Um, I was just looking outside the window, and I noticed the tree is like, I don't know, like, the tree house, yeah? A part of the tree house is going through the tree. How is that possible? Who is this? I'm oh, so we're talking to the little this girl now. House. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. How old are you? I'm not going to ask her where her parents are because I'm guessing they probably yes. got eaten by zombies. I don't zombies. know where anybody is. How old are you? Or uh, eaten, I should say. Okay. Where are your Wait, parents? I'm gonna have to. They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my tree house. They can't get in. That's smart. See? The wooden See? plank for the tree house is going through the tree. The what the hell? My game. Oh, crap. It's lagging a bit. Damn it, Lee. What the hell? You're always falling. Again. Quick. Come on. Get the hammer, man. Get the hammer. Hammer time. Hammer time. Hammer time. You have a hammer in your head. She looks like my bacon. Because I can't bake. Man. Cause my food looks like a rake. I can't rap. Hi there. Did you kill it? Um, someone else did. I think something else did. Or Before something me, else. I, I heard her scream two nights ago. Maybe one of the monsters got her. Two nights ago? Yeah, that's probably what smart happened. girl. She is. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah, I want my parents to come home now. What I the hell does she eat? Right like, does she eat grass? You know? Does she just like go oh. on the floor and like pick well, some up? I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until- Om nom nom grass. What should we do now? Um, okay guys, what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna end episode one. And see you guys in episode 2. And remember guys. Oh yeah army. If you want more. Um, games like this. Just suggest them to me and I'll play them. So yeah. See you guys later. Peace out. Cookies. Munchies. Chicken. KFC. I don't know.